morning folks, welcome to our fourth day here in the Kruger National Park. Woke up early, packed the bucky, we left Victoria's Corp and we're now here at Transported Dam. And we are lucky enough to see one of the Kruger greats. There's not many of the big tuskers left. And we have just found one swimming and bathing here in Transport Dam. Absolutely stunning. Just have a look at this. can't get better than that what a blessing anyway we're driving up to Timboti today so we'll show you the drive and what it's like we'll let you know if we see anything interesting come along for the ride while I've got you here give this video a like give us a subscribe now come along for the adventure so on today's drive we're gonna go all the way from Petrius Corp up to Open Gate. That's where the Timboti camp is situated, just about three kilometers away from the Open Gate, but you have to actually sign in at the Open Gate. So it's about 185 kilometers to get there. So on the speed limit of 50 kilometers an hour, you're looking probably at about four hours. But believe me, from experience, it never takes four hours. It always takes longer. So in the map book it actually says to seven hours because that actually equates for stoppages and things like that. So we're going to probably take even longer than that. So let's get going because we've got a long drive ahead of us. But come along for the adventure. We had one of the viewpoints here on the way to Sitara. It's just a massive rock. Look at this magnificent view behind me. Here. See one big rock, massive piece of granite. On our way to Tamburti, we stopped here at Tukwane picnic spot. We didn't really see much on the road here between between Skakuza and here so far. A couple of elephants but nothing else. We're gonna have a look and see if we can get some lunch here and then we'll take it from here. Also a nice little picnic spot. Looks like wherever you come in the Kruger, if you come to these picnic spots, they are perfectly well positioned and having lunch in the bush like this. I am going to have a roosterkoek. I'm going to have a South African favorite, a roosterkoek with some bacon, egg and cheese on it. <laughs> roosterkoek has arrived. Look at that. Bacon, egg and cheese. That is what a roaster cook is. Let's give it a taste. Mm. Absolutely delicious. Just what the doctor ordered. 
we're still on our way to Timbuti, but lunch is the best thing since sliced bread. We can enjoy this and we will see you on the road. In July, I showed you the baobabs. Then the baobabs didn't have any leaves. Now the leaves are back, so this is what a baobab looks like when it's got leaves on it. And you can see the size of the trunk of that tree. I don't think even 15 men or 20 men can go around there holding hands. Just have a look at the massive size of it. Come to the Kruger, it's not just about the animals, also keep a look out for the trees. Baobabs, stunning tree to see. That's all we've seen so far since we've left our lunch spot. We haven't seen much yet. We on our way to Satara. So let's see what we can see. It is damn hot in the park though, but not as hot as yesterday, but it is still damn hot today. We've got some Giraffes in front of us. It used to be seen here. Always action around here.
didn't see much on our way back from Sitara but we're not there just yet we've got about an hour's worth of drive to get to Tomboti so hopefully we'll see a bit more action on the way it's so peaceful out here Well folks, we've made it to my favorite camp in the Kruger at Tamboti. We've just booked in here at reception at the open gate. Gonna get some ice and some cold drinks for the night. And then we're off to our camp at Tamboti and we'll show you a bit more of that. You've seen that in one of our previous videos, but like I said, it is my favorite spot in the Kruger National Park. So I had to come back here. So we'll show you that. But first, let's get some ice and we'll take it from there. We left it a bit late to get here, so it's getting dark and we need to still unpack, so we're in a rush to quickly get everything out the back and unpacked, get everybody settled, getting everything ready. And we're going to make a braai and probably get into bed early because it was a long drive going coming up here. Let's give you a quick look at what our tent looks like here. It's our room. It's just me and Bevin here tonight. So this is the inside of our tents here at Tamboti. Which is quite nice. You can see out the door there we've got a bit of a view. Not bad at all. Don't know if anything gives you the idea that it's hot here in the Kruger, but it's about quarter to seven at night. And I'm still sweating, so you know it really really is quite hot here in the Kruger this time of the year. But it's beautiful just seeing everything green and lush. Last time we were in uh, Tamboti, it was winter. So it wasn't as green and lush as now. So tomorrow morning we'll show you in the sunlight, a little bit around the camp again, show you what it looks like in summer. Ik zei zelfs krut het bang voor mij en zo zwaar. Morning folks, we're still here at Tamboti in the Kruger National Park, we've come out for an early morning game drive, we had a very long drive yesterday, we might not have seen much in terms of animals, but that what we did see was absolutely special, we saw one of the great tuskers here in the Kruger National Park, and dropped it all off. We went for a bath to just see him play around in the water was stunning. We sat there for about half an hour just watching him before he got up and walked off. And then we took on this long drive and we saw a herd of zebras like I've never seen before. It was amazing to see the amount of zebras all in one spot. But anyway, that's this for this video. In our next video, we'll show you a little bit more of Tamboti and go for more game drives. Hopefully, we'll be lucky then. If you want to see that, then just check our next video. But if you like this kind of videos, give this one a like. Give us a subscribe. Bring that bell for notifications because we don't post every week. And then, like always, remember, get out there, go and explore the sunshine for yourself. See you in the next one. Cheers.